day six ninety nine. Just in the middle of eating. I was gonna do the video later, but I couldn't resist. I was so excited for this food for some reason. Like I've had it before. It just stayed. It kind of made a fajita thing out of it. I have tortillas right here. Tortillas. Just quick. Just throwing a little meat on there with the veggies slightly marinated in. Adding in a little guac. Giving some of the pup. Watching the movie. Well, not watching the movie. Watching the show. I was not sure what to watch. And then just the circle came on. I was like, yep, that'll work. That will do. So I'm trying to eat. Trying to watch the show. And I just... I was, I don't know excited about it the food even when I was buying it I was like, oh my god I cannot wait to have these little fajita type fajita type burritos I, I don't know so we've got plenty for tomorrow we already had two earlier and these ones are kind of full I'm gonna load them up load them up with some guac Stay. Stay there. Don't fall. Please don't fall. I just figured I'd talk now so that way I can save time for. Oh, sorry, my nose is going. save time for fitness later and just sit down and do it and I don't have to worry about doing two things I'll have this one already uploaded I'll have a full stomach the only thing I'm actually worried about now is trying to do any kind of fitness with four fajitas in my stomach four steak fajitas Distracted after the run, just doing the shopping, and I found something that someone was looking for, and then I was looking for, for pup food, and I got pup food. But then on the way out, there was. Why won't it stay there? On the way out, there was a little bit of a sale going on with some pup toys, a pup collar, and let me just show you. So I got the pup, the new, you see it? It's kind of going, let me try this. There we go, that's a lot better. I just thought since it's still so dark at night, just use that. That way cars can see me and the dog. I mean, it was only originally, I think we said they were $30, and I got them for seven. One was eight, sorry, one was ten. So I got the collar and then the leash. And then I also got her a cool new chew toy, which is just made out of a. What is it made out of? Like a fire hydrant? Or a fire hose. As I said, oh, it's great. It's light. It's squishy. It's big enough to fit in her mouth. Come on, get it. <laughs> she apparently likes it so far. So. Oh, well, the rest of the day. It felt weird going back to work today. It's the first Monday in a while that. I had to go back. Are ready? Go. And then it's gonna be a full week, so it's not like I'm switching days with anyone. Yeah, I'm gonna have to be there Monday through Friday, which you definitely get spoiled after having that. It's hard to go back. 
And so everyone just seemed like, felt like this week is gonna drag. <clears throat> I already feel it. I already felt like I should have been napping. trying to eat and it's already 8 40 8 40 and there's the rest of the, the steak and type but the run the run I'm getting so sidetracked and caught off by all this food I'm getting caught up by all the food I just want to sit down and eat so the run after work, I went down to the park and I just did easy six miles. So I stayed on the canal, didn't do any hills, and I did some drills and strides, just some tail kicks, some heel to toe, using these stretches, and then um, quad, hamstring, and a little side side knee stretch, which felt really good. I, Left IT band and it's been getting tight and it kinda felt like stretch out in the hip area. And then I did two or three fast drills and then did three strides. About 80% effort. It was a little bit of an incline too, so I wasn't too too worried about pushing the pace. I knew it was already gonna be a little bit taxing. I'm trying to recover this week. I'm just trying to stay loose, stay bust things out, keep things moving. So the pace was average 735, which felt good. And then after that, I went to the dog store, <clears throat> got food, got her toys, got the leash collar, went into Ross, was looking at the type of TV stand, just something to kind of keep in the corner for a thin screen TV. And then saw some other fitness stuff. I'm like, one of those sliders where you can just put them on tile and just slide but I know you can also use towels for the same thing but I definitely want to stay focused after the half marathon and just keep with the fitness and do more core more squats more push-ups pull-ups more weights so I'm trying to have things ready but then went to the grocery store got some chicken got some steak got some bananas it's kind of the best ones I could find. They're really green. I don't know if the camera's showing it or not. They are really green, so I'm hoping by tomorrow, if not the next day, I'll be able, I'll be able to have some. I'm trying to get some extra potassium in before the race. Just all, doing all these little things to help help for the race on Sunday. And then I got news today that it's supposed to rain right at 7 when the race is starting. Well, I think actually races might start at 8. But either way, running a race and then running a race in rain isn't, <laughs> isn't ideal when you're trying to get a new PR. So I'm a little worried, but I'm just trying to stay focused. Focus on what I can control and keep going from there. But <clears throat> I'm ready to sit down. I'm watching The Circle again, episode 6 right now, and then I'm going to eat, hopefully give myself an hour and see how I feel about trying to do the salsa again and then a little bit of dancing, so maybe 15 minutes of each, and then shower up and try to wind down, so I might go back to The Circle after all that, but yeah, yeah, that's the day. So run your life with health and happiness and have a good night.